What's good YouTube? This video is part two of the working Android apps for the BlackBerry Classic in 2022. If you like this kind of content or find this kind of content helpful, leave a message down below. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching. So by popular demand, here are this part two of the working Android apps available for BlackBerry. Surprisingly, the BlackBerry Classic is still working in 2022 after its official end of life. And what's even more surprising is that even though BlackBerry is isn't supporting this device with official software updates, the Android runtime environment is still kicking and able to run some very useful Android apps. This video will go over some of the more useful ones that I have found to be perfectly operational on the BlackBerry Classic in 2022. Most of these apps will require you to have Google Play Store and Google Play services running on your BlackBerry Classic to successfully operate. So if you don't already have Google Play services running on the Classic, check out my link in the video in the description below for a step-by-step -step guide on how to install Google Play services and the Google Play Store on your BlackBerry Classic. Considering that this phone is over five years old and it's running quite a dated runtime environment for Android, some of these apps may not be working smoothly, but I was surprised to see that the core functionality of these apps is still functional on the BlackBerry Classic running BlackBerry 10. So without further ado, let's get into the list of apps that are currently working on the BlackBerry Classic for the Android runtime environment. Skype. Yes, the popular messaging service and video service is fully operational on the BlackBerry Classic in 2022. This comes as much of a relief as without the BlackBerry Messenger working on the BlackBerry Classic, our options for messaging on the BlackBerry Classic is quite limited. The video and messaging functions on Skype for the BlackBerry Classic are still working and even though video isn't the smoothest or the fastest, it's still capable of making video call. And having video calls on a phone with this kind of form factor, with this kind of size, is actually quite a nice change of pace compared to the larger phones that you usually use to make video calls in 2022. So if you're looking for a messaging and or video call option, get Skype for free today on the Play Store on your BlackBerry Classic. Telegram. The popular messaging app Telegram is working on the BlackBerry Classic and in the same vein as Skype, it is an ample replacement for BlackBerry Messenger which of course died off a few years ago. So if you have a lot of friends on Telegram and that you use Telegram to either send messages with your friend group and or media with your friend group, then you'll be happy to hear that Telegram is working on the BlackBerry Classic in 2022. The install procedure for Telegram is a little bit different and doesn't actually involve going through the Play Store. So if you'd like a step-by-step -step guide on how to install Telegram on the BlackBerry Classic, check out my link in the video in the description below for a guide on how to install this messaging app on your phone. Khan Academy. The BlackBerry Classic was always meant to be a productivity device and with some doing I find that this is still very possible in 2022. Things like word processing and also messaging and emails can still be done on the BlackBerry Classic. But what I was, what I was even more happy to hear is that one of my favorite learning apps, Khan Academy, is fully functional on the BlackBerry Classic. So while you're trying to be productive on the BlackBerry Classic, if you'd like to learn a new skill or study for a particular exam, the videos of Khan Academy are available to you. What I really got a kick out was that the form factor and the one-to-one -one screen on the BlackBerry Classic could actually play the videos from Khan Academy. And I actually found that the smaller screen and form factor really helped me multitask and have a new skill or video from Khan Academy playing while I was doing other things on other devices. So if you're like me and like to be continuously learning new skills and or polishing up some of your previous knowledge, you'll be happy to hear that Khan Academy is working on the BlackBerry Classic in 2022. Get it for free today on the Play Store. Via Browser with a lot of apps not working on BlackBerry 10 and the lack of updates or software updates from BlackBerry, you're left with looking for workarounds for a lot of functions that modern smartphones have. And one of the best ways to execute these workarounds is to have a good browser. The 
internet browser on the blackberry classic that comes loaded by default is still going strong and it can be used for a rather clumsy and slow internet experience but nonetheless can still be functional particularly if you're looking for basic web browser based applications thankfully with google play services still running on the blackberry classic we have a lot of options in terms of the browser department and alternatives that we can use to access some web-based applications and functionality. And one of my favorite is Via Browser. Via Browser is a nice tab-based lightweight browser that can be used for browsing the web. While it doesn't operate some of the other things and more intensive web-based apps like email as good as some of the other browsers available like Dolphin Browser or Opera, it's still a very quick browser for quickly browsing websites and reading text on the web. So if you're looking for a faster option than the, the default browser on the BlackBerry Classic, look no further than Via Browser, available for free today on the Play Store. So there you have it everyone, just a set of apps that make it a lot easier for you to continue using your BlackBerry 10 device and in particular the BlackBerry Classic. It's surprising just how long this phone has lasted and how far a Android runtime environment that is quite a few years old can take your phone. What's also quite surprising is just the number of people that are still using this phone and the amount of demand for a QWERTY keyboard devices. I get a lot of messages and there's a lot of comments asking about what's the best messaging app or what's the best browsing app for the BlackBerry Classic as there's still a lot of interest in this phone. And what I think does drive this interest is both the unique form factor and of course the ta tactile typing experience that you get from a BlackBerry keyboard. Despite messaging apps and despite smartphones advancing over the years, there's really no substitute for the messaging that you get on the BlackBerry keyboard. And for this reason, apps like Telegram and Skype still have a function on QWERTY keyboard devices. Hopefully, BlackBerry will pick up on this and they'll incorporate this kind of messaging functionality in the upcoming 5G BlackBerry smartphone. Check out some of my videos in the link in the description below if you're interested in seeing some of the latest updates from BlackBerry in regards to their 2022 5G Android phone. Hopefully with these videos and the continued support and continued demand from BlackBerry enthusiasts, BlackBerry will realize that there's still quite a lot of interest and attention in a QWERTY keyboard phone that can be used for messaging and other smartphone applications. But in the meantime, we still have the excellent BlackBerry Classic, and hopefully with these lists of still functioning Android apps, we can use this device for at least a few years, or at least this year. So if you have other apps that you think are still working on your BlackBerry Classic, leave a message down below. Don't forget to subscribe and 